Hello everyone, my name is Yatsu Tan. I'm back with a new makeup look. Today I'm gonna be making Poison Ivy from the DC Universe. First I'm gonna be using my Essence Hello Good Stuff CBD Face Primer and I already put on my beautiful red wig that I love so so much. So I'm just gonna apply this with my hand. Then I'm gonna be using my Bourjois Healthy Mix Foundation that I recently bought and after this I was thinking about that I am using a CBD primer and the foundation with vitamins not doing makeup I'm making a facial treatment so I just apply it with the beauty blender I really love using beauty blenders for this kind of stuff I think it's more prettier than using a brush so I love using blenders and after that I'm using this called Novo Stay Flawless uh, Face Makeup. It's just for contouring and highlighting and th this stuff. And I just apply it everywhere to make my nose smaller, cuter. And when I was doing the highlighting, there was a little uh, accident, <laughs> as you can see. But then I proceeded to put it back and do it the rest of it so it was not a huge thing and I don't even remember what I did after this. yeah I did my I just blended out with the bit, same beauty blender don't use too much beauty blender I hate using way too much stuff because then I have to clean a lot of things I already have to clean another batch of makeup brushes and these things because I didn't need the ones that I used at the weekend so I'm using my Maybelline Afternitone powder to set it what I did previously it looks super nice together I really love this foundation and I'm not a big fan of this contouring kit but I liked it today then I'm using my NYX HD Studio Photogenic eyeshadow base I think I said it a lot of times, but not enough times that I really love it and it was a big game changer for me. I'm not doing eyeshadow without this. Then I'm using my Biology eyeshadow palette, the number 4, because this is the one that has the greens and I need greens for Poison Ivy. So I'm just be be blah, building it up from the lightest, then I'm gonna be doing a little bit darker green in the crease and blend it kind of together so I just want this nice blend with all these greens that I have then I'm gonna be doing it under my eyes too because I want to put the color under there then I'm using the darkest green that I have I usually don't do in this I don't work this order, but I don't want it to changing the palettes in my hand all the time. It was easier for me to do this and then to do a lighter one in the inner corner of my eyelid. That I use a different palette, the Essence Never Give Up Your Daydream eyeshadow palette that I usually use only for highlight or as a highlighter, but I use it as an eyeshadow as it's supposed to be on my inner corner of my eyelid. And then I use a other color the sweet dreams if i'm right uh, on as a highlighter on my cheeks on my nose and under my eyebrows and on the cupid bow and after that i brought out my next suit i don't know how they say it matte lipstick in the color spicy i recently got this for my birthday for my sister and i filled my eyebrows with it first i wanted to do a little bit uh, not that thick, a thinner, fine line eyebrows because I want it to be a little bit a st stronger, sexier feature to be, I don't want it, I want it to be strong and I needed it uh, to match my wig a little bit so that's why I decided to do this and then I did my lips and finally I don't uh how to say it oh i don't remember the word so it was visible when i did it 
my lips so it's first for me that you can see what I'm doing here because I always accidentally hide it behind the thing that I'm using as a mirror so I'm a good point for me that I learned this then I'm using my L'Oreal Bombay mascara I love this when I saw this first I was like I need to get it and it was worth it because I love this mascara so so much I use it almost all the time when I'm doing a makeup and I like it how it's cartoony and big it makes my eyes and I just love it so this is the finished look when I end it I don't know why I'm looking so sad right now when I was so satisfied with it and I loved it now now I'm a little bit in the mood if you like this please let me know don't forget to subscribe there's a lot of links in the description that you should check out and see you in the next video bye